only purpose of man's sojourn on this earth is to seek God. Okay, can you speak more articulate slowly? Come on, let me hear you. How can you stop? Onslaught. How can you stop the onslaught on the culture of India? You have to get up from your sloth. Don't worry what others are doing. Do your own stuff. Do better marketing. Do better sales. Put up better pictures and educate people that it shouldn't be like a cult or uh, something very, very uh, hyper-religious, but it should be more of the universal values of humanity. I'm teaching the true Sanatan Dharma. If earth peace, you want to hear what Hinduism or Sanatan Dharma is, I'll tell you. Here it is. It, it covers everything and it's superior to all the other religions because it absorbs them. If earth peace is to herald the dawn of the new age, we must all realize that humanity is our uniting religion. Breath, our uniting prayer, and consciousness, our uniting God. This is the template I've made for the United Nations organization. They have none. Because none of these guys have thought of us saying like this. But because we are ordinary guys, we are not known. It's not done. If Mahatma Gandhi had said it, it would be in letters of gold. I? I, I. Yeah, so. All we souls, our manifesto is, we the hamsas, we the souls, are meditated to the furthering of human awareness. We are dedicated to serving humanity as our larger self. And we are devoted to new life awakening for earth peace healing through self peace healing. Now, can the Buddhist adopt this? Yes. Can the Indian adopt it? Yes. No, no response. You don't understand. Yes. 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 Can the Muslim adopt it? Yes. yes. Hindu adopt it? Yes. yes. Buddhist adopt it? Yes. yes. Atheist adopt it? Yes. And theist adopt it. So, uh, this is what India teaches. This is the true secularism and it's universal. And it should fit the whole of humanity. Even if you have one man less than humanity, you're a cult. And my teachings are not a cult because the whole humanity is with us. Breath, our uniting prayer.